Lord shall watch your going out and your coming in from this time forth forevermore. With the Lord's blessing, or at least that of Anglican Bishop Philip Wright, St. John's Credit Union Limited was open for business this morning in its new north side location on the Philip Goldson Highway. The St. John's Cathedral and the Anglican Diocese take some credit in the start of this credit union. And over the years it goes without saying that um, an institution like this has helped many people, uh, especially at times the, the poor and those who need a, a helping hand. And this expansion to the north side, I think, just simply speaks of the growth of the credit union and the fact that um, it, it, it is expanding its services to the general public. President of St. John's Credit Union's Board of Directors, Alvan Haynes, credits the need for a new office to a strategic expansion of growth in membership and services. Since 2012, as a direct result of executing our strategic plan, SJCU has experienced phenomenal growth in assets, loans, and membership. Membership has increased by over 50% during this period, and assets and shares by over 100%. Today marks the official inauguration of another milestone in our growth. One, as Sister Brenda mentioned, which many members and prospective members have been clamoring for, for years, many of them. Guest speaker and former banker, Mayor Bernard Wagner, paid tribute to the organization's humble origins and expressed interest in greater partnership. From its founded in a little rundown St. John's school classroom on Albert Street on November 8, 1946, to its Basra Street location in 1984, to today's symbolic opening here on the Philip Golson Highway. My friends, throughout it all, St. John's Credit Union has continued to represent community-based goals, community-based vision, community-based values, and character, while improving the social development of its members through the provision of high quality, efficient, innovative, and affordable financial services. It's always important to, to nurture relationships, um, not only in the area of, of banking or in credit union, but we want to be able to, to nurture all relationship with all our business associates across the city. We want to be known as a council that caters for business um, entities, for business establishment, um, we want to send a clear message that, listen, uh, uh, we are open for business, we are business friendly, we want to work along with you to ensure that your business um, prosper and as well the city prosper. Now the work continues, according to General Manager D.C. Dawson. Let us continue to work to provide the efficient services that we need to do for our members and to make sure that we keep on that sustainable growth that we protect our members savings we have to ensure that we're doing what is right the regulator is here and we have to make sure that we're doing the right things they're holding our hands along the way we're on the right path but we all have to work together as a team including our members including the business community so we all have to work together Aaron Humes reporting for News 5.